Hello everybody, it is I, once again, your one and only Tokure, taking you through the Hirata Estate memory. Before we get started, don't forget to like and subscribe, and enable the bell notification button so you know the moment new content drops your way. Now adventurers, let's get to questing. Who knows how many parts there are. So we've pretty much, I think we've pretty much gone through this whole area. Uh, I don't remember if I went through here or not. There is definitely a uh, path. Oh, oh, look at that. Cool. And there's like something else way over there. Yeah. You, you can't break through these. Which is kind of weird because, I mean, we have the means to get through with bamboo, or get through bamboo. Um, is that a path to it? It could be. I mean, there's definitely, I mean, there's something there. We can all see it. Let's just figure out how to get over there. They, um, they really know how to hide things. <laughs> uh, this is, uh, you really just got to keep on your toes with basically everything. So that looks like it's a path. It's not. So we can't even get out there for whatever reason. Okay. So we've got one guy here. And some shield guys. I want to try something. I want to see. How do we do this move? It was L1 plus R1, right? So if I'm in the guard, if I just press. Well, let's try it this way. It's got a really cool classic retro uh, martial arts movie sound. Can you do that yet from the guard? That's really cool. One thing I wish would happen is at least I can't tell if it's the case, but you know, if you take out the if you take out the lamps, you know, these torch lamps, sconce things, uh, it would make you less likely to be detected, because... Come here. Why am I going backwards? I'm gonna press forward. Oh no. Status abnormalities. Status abnormalities have a variety of negative effects in battle. Before an abnormality is fully inflicted, a resistance gauge is shown. When the resistance is full, wolf becomes afflicted. There are items which suppress the resistance gauge or outright cure these abnormalities. Okay. Why am I going forward again? Honestly, we sacrificed Foreman strategy just to try out the, <laughs> the the ability. I'm totally guilty. All right, so we got three pellets, healing gourd. Um, you know, makes a good point. We might want. We don't really use fistful of ash right now. This I'm finding completely useless. I'm not really digging it a whole lot so light coin purse this is interesting I think you I think it's like dung piles I think it's gonna be a way um, I was thinking about this with the merchant that you can buy them for 123 coins uh, to the merchant or you can sell them for a hundred and so that tells me that kind of like dung piles it's a way for me to save my gold uh, with a slight, um, with a slight cost, but prevents me from losing it. Where am I? What am I? Oh, dousing powder. That's what I'm looking for. Okay. And I, I still. 
Why do I have... I thought... Oh, yeah. Okay. We don't have anything in here. Anyway, so that's my ideas, like the dung piles. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's from Dark Souls. Um, and it was a really great way of kind of saving your souls. Uh, you can hold up to like 99 of them. Or no, 100. What, what was it? Like 199 in your storage, 99 in your person. I came up to, I think, like... 50 or 75,000 souls, but it was worth it. All right, I gotta figure, I gotta get up here. It's where I wanna be. Uh, I can only jump around things. There we go. Although, I think I'm just kind of doomed to walk into these guys. At least target them. No. These guys have shields. And it's the first time we've had this, so I don't really sure what to do here. Is there simply just a kick move? I don't know. I'm gonna kick the shields. Oh man, nope, don't do that. No, I don't know how to kick. I don't think there is a kick. Alright, we're gonna use one pellet, just because I don't like being so low. I probably could run past these guys, but where's the fun of that? I think what what I do is just throw a knife, or knife. Throw a shooting can. Uh, if they get to that position. Come on. Okay, I'm just kind of feeling them out. Feeling them out. I want to try to see if I can get on top, but the issue is. is Oh man, I can't even get my guard up fast enough for that. That shield bash. There we go. We'll learn it. Fortunately, it looks like these guys just all have crazy posture. I think what I gotta do is wait for me to get that like swipe attack. It costs them so much time that perhaps I can just get to the side like I did. All right, we got a bunch going on here. I don't like these torches. They make me nervous. Well, hello, branch. That tells me I'm supposed to go down there. But to what end? I don't know. However, okay, so we got a bunch of guys up here. And some guy. I forget what they're called, those fork like martial arts weapons. Some crazy spears. I almost wonder if I meant to. I meant to perhaps kind of play stealth. And we do have candy for that, I think. Um, I really want to get down there. I'm going to take out this guy. Though. Yeah. 
Don't forget all about me. jump over there. Is that just me or I guess he could kind of see me like that. There you go. That's a bit better. Yeah. Okay. Angles are funny. He's got my number though. He's lost my number. I wonder if I could do this without being seen. Quiet like a fish. We definitely need to go stealth kill this guy. Oh my goodness. Okay, you know what? We're gonna <laughs> belay that order. I have an idea. So he's a multi parter, and we don't know anything about him at all. So let's. the other stealth stuff here. We're going to take out these other guys and move from there. Um, oh, you know what? That high ground at least gave us some information. So he's kind of watching. I wish you could just drop down. Alright. I don't care so much about Torch Guy, to be honest. He's gonna see me first, but. Maybe not. Countering thrust attacks. Thrust attacks cannot be blocked, but they can be deflected. The Mikiri counter skill also counters thrust attacks, and performing it successfully will deal greater posture damage than a normal deflect. I don't think we have the Mikiri counter yet. All right. We lost gold. Let's check this out. Acquiring skills. So we have the whirlwind and uh, the Mikiri counter. Okay. Um, acquires Shinobi martial or acquires Shinobi martial art. Right. Mikiri counter enables one to counter enemy at, uh, thrust attacks by stomping down on an enemy's weapon, dealing a large amount of damage to posture. Uh oh. It is nearly impossible to perceive the speed of a thrust, but not for sharp eyes of Shinobi. Okay, what else is it like that? Uh, circle, the moment an enemy thrust attack lands, make a counter, stomp on the enemy sword to render a thrust ineffective and deal a large amount of posture damage. Okay. Well, oops, no, we backed out. All right, I guess we're investing in that one. Well, what else we got here? Whirlwind Slash. The spinning attack that can hit several enemies at once. The sharp cut combined with the force of the spin can strike multiple foes and deal damage even when guarded. When surrounded by enemies, this shinobi technique can cut open a path to victory. Oh, it's just that thing. L1, R1. Where is it going to? Mid-air guard? Uh, oh, yeah. I like that. 
Um, Shinobi's karma body. Acquires latent skill, a Shinobi's karma body. Increases the maximum number of spirit emblems that can be held. Oh yeah, look at that. I like it. It's nice as you'll eventually be able to get all these, right? Alright, let's look at uh, run and slide. While sprinting, slide. Ending a sprint by sliding, which puts you in a crouched position. Oh, that's nice. Okay. These look like sneaky stuff, maybe. Suppress presence. Acquires... The latent skill suppress presence, a latent skill that reduces an enemy's ability to perceive those who are in stealth. Removing one's presence is part of what defines a shinobi. Okay, I think we're going to get this one for now. I think the smart thing to do would be to farm a little bit. Um, get our money back. <laughs> uh, and, uh, yeah, I think that it's probably the thing that needs to happen. Let's get our money back, move forward. And with that, we'll uh, do some movie magic. Okay, so we did some farming, and here we are. Uh, so we have our counter. We have the whirlwind splash, or splash. We have the whirlwind slash. Um, so that'll hit multiple foes. I don't know if we're really going to use it, but it's you know you, you need it for these trees as you're going forward. Um, we're gonna have the shinobi's karma body. This gives us a little bit. A few more spirit emblems. I think it only gave us one extra uh, mid-air air deflection, so we can put the guard up in the air. So that's pretty cool. Uh, run and slide, so we can go right into a sneak from uh, a sprint. Uh, we're a little harder to detect. That's great. Um, and then this is also making us a little bit harder to detect. Not by much. That's important here. Not by a whole lot. Um, and then Shinobi Eyes acquires latent skill. Shinobi Eyes increases the damage inflicted to posture upon executing a successful Mikiri counter. The Shinobi's eyes do not follow the blade without anticipating its movements. Remaining composed even when fearful of its sharp edge is key to victory. So that's where we're at. Uh, I could have kept farming, but I didn't want to get ahead of ourselves. Not that we're necessarily getting ahead of ourselves. I feel like... The Hirata Estate is a perfect place for this, uh, for farming. So if you haven't done so already, this is a perfect place for farming. You just do a couple loop, loops and and bam, you've got some skill points. Um, and I really, I just didn't want to get too far into it. You know, just kind of uh, get them naturally as we go along. If we feel like farming again later, we will. We're going to go back and unlock our Shinobi prosthetic tools. 
That is it for this episode, folks. As always, thank you for tuning in and sharing in the experience with me. I hope you enjoyed your time here. I know that I enjoyed having you with me. On your way out, please don't forget to throw us a like. If you're new here, smash that subscribe button and enable the bell notification so you can stay on top of the new content the moment it heads your way. Say hello in the comments section below. I promise to say hello back. Until next time, everyone, this is Tokere signing off.